There are many miles to drive and many heavy loads to lift before we can end the petrol age and the burning of fossil fuels, which causes climate change. Lord Banford, the chairman of the British heavy vehicle maker JCB, believes he's found what could be the most important invention of the 21st century. Not electricity, not fuel cells, but the internal combustion of hydrogen, one of the basic components of water, H2O. We started with batteries. and Could we not have batteries across our range of machines? And we found for various reasons the batteries didn't work. So we had to look at an alternative, and the alternative was, was a fuel cell which is powered by hydrogen. The JCB team found that batteries were too heavy and fuel cells too complex and expensive. They also needed plug-in points. The technology for internal combustion engines is better known, adapted this time for hydrogen. We understand batteries, but we also stand, understand the limitations of both, both the product and the infrastructure. We've experimented with fuel cells and we realise that fuel cells have limitations. I think our customers always challenge us to produce machines that aren't too complicated, aren't too expensive for the market they serve. And this hydrogen combustion solution is just perfect for that. But hydrogen shares a problem with electricity. It'll only help save the planet if it is generated without burning fossil fuels. At the moment, around 95% of the hydrogen created for use in the UK is generated from fossil fuels. Where hydrogen has got a role to play is where the battery simply doesn't give us the functionality needed for longer distance travel or movement of heavier things. So could hydrogen be used to power yeah, lighter oh, vehicles yeah. such as the family runabout? Fiona Spowers thinks so. She and her yeah. husband have raised five million pounds through crowdfunding to build these prototypes yeah. in Wales. I think it's going to be very good for the corner cases where batteries won't work. So if you lived, I don't know, in a third floor flat uh, in a town, it's going to be pretty hard work trying to re uh, recharge a battery electric car. Hydrogen is potentially portable through pipes, compressed in canisters and in liquid form at super low temperatures. Fiona has a dream. Well, I'm thinking the forecourt of the future should have hydrogen and electricity uh, replacing diesel and, and petrol. And I think we will see that. But at present, there are pitifully few hydrogen stations in the UK, just 14 across the whole country. The private hydrogen car market still has much further to go.